So we'll see if Jacob Rogers can put the Pelicans on the board. He is certainly one to try to do it. First pitch to him, a breaking ball in the outer edge, 0-1. And, and it was a dash base from him. Exactly. So Lair was perfect for the first four before the leadoff double by Rogers in the fifth inning. And he takes outside and low, one ball and a strike. Last night in uh, the fourth and the seventh innings were all one, two, three when I was on the air. So Rogers is going to try to break that trend here. Team leader in homers with 10. Here's the 1-1. One, one, and it misses outside. Two balls and one strike. He's got some very good opposite field power. He's so tall, he's got very long arms. Can really reach that outside part of the plate and put some good lumber on the baseball. The wind is also blowing out straight to left now, so anything in the air, he could send it out. Instead, he swings at a 2-1 fastball at 95 miles an hour, and he comes up empty. And the fans here at the ballpark giving oohs and ahs as he came up empty on that one. Just shy of 9 o'clock here on a Wednesday evening in Myrtle Beach. 82 degrees and beautiful. Here's a 2-2 now from Lair, and it misses off the outer edge. And it's three balls and two strikes. Rogers also has a penchant for the walk. He's third in the Carolina League with 42. That's behind Mark Sagunis with 55, who came into today tied with Lynchburg's Mike Pappy, also with 55. 3-2 pitch fouled off the top of the screen, and we'll try it one more time. That foul ball was brought to you by Brady Glass Solutions. For more information on all your glass needs, call 843-957-2546. Rogers really battling here. The big lefty facing the righty, Robinson Lair, who so far has shut out the Pelicans through six and a third. A high fly, left field side, that one curling toward the beach and out of play. Added onto the uh, the stairwell there that goes down to Pelicans Beach. And a, a fan will pick it up, and uh, I think that's going to the youngster down there. Waiting on deck. Is Victor Caratini so far today 0 for 2? Just like most everyone else, Rogers with the only extra base hit tonight and one of two. An extra base hit, Trey Martin with a bunt single. Swing and a miss, and Lair wins that battle. Rogers strikes out swinging, and that's the first strikeout for him tonight, but it is the fifth of the evening for the righty Robinson Lair. <laughs> 